Okay, so tropical bats play important roles in the rain ecosystem, aiding in the disposal of cashew, date, and fig seeds. Pollinating banana, breadfruit, and mango trees, aiding, pollinating, and indirectly helping. I guess this is this is aiding, pollinating, and I guess you need something like helping over here. That's what I would and helping produce. You need helping over here. This seems to me some big modifiers: aiding, pollinating, X, Y, and Z. Aiding X, Y, and Z. Thinking it's aiding. X, Y, and Z, pollinating M, N, and O, and helping A, B, and C. They're all different, and that's why. So I'm looking for something like that. So I, I would personally get rid of this help. This is wrong. Eating pollinating mango trees and helping, yeah, helping. This seems like aiding, pollinating and indirectly helping produce, helping and helping to produce. I think this is okay, helping to produce. Seems okay, pollinating and they indirectly, no, you need, this is parallelism. Now it could be aiding in dispersal. They pollinate and indirectly help producing. So if they pollinate, they pollinate X, Y, and Z and indirectly help producing, that, that's not parallel. So I'm gonna get rid of that. They pollinate and indirectly helping the producing of the pro in well this is not you notice this is not if you look very closely this is not a comma this is a what they call a semicolon semicolon i think is talking should be talking about examples what come i i think you need they pollinate bread, but if you have a semicolon, what this should be talking about is this. I don't think it's doing it. They pollinate X banana, breadfruit, and mango trees, colon, like the time when in, in 2021, January, when they did that. I don't think the word semicolon makes sense here. Yeah. yeah, so I would personally select B because it's just so parallel. They indirectly, there needs to be a comma or, a, you know, this strange that it's starting with indirect, helping the producing of, helping the production, helping to produce. I don't think the producing of, that's a gerund. Helping the production of, the producing of. Also, I'm not sure about this, the producing of. So at this point, I would select B. Let's move on. So, okay. In March 2020, the CBS survey showed that Mexico accounted for more than a quarter of all foreign born residents of the United States. The Mexico accounted for more than a quarter of all foreign born residents of the United States. What does that mean exactly? Is this talking about illegal immigration or legal immigration? In a March 2000 Census Bureau survey showed that Mexico 
accounted for more than a quarter of all foreign born residents of the United States. <sighs> what do you mean by foreign born resident? Does that mean that your mom is Mexican? She came over and she gave birth in America and thus your son is a foreign born resident? What does that mean by a foreign born resident of the United States? I'm not sure what that means. Anyways, I, I think this is talking about legal immigration. Mexico accounted for more than a quarter of all foreign born residents. I think this is talking about legal immigrants. Like, okay, so of all the legal immigrants, not illegal, the legal immigrants, because it's so close, people are just walking across and giving birth in the United States. I think that's what it's talking about. Mexico accounted for more than a quarter. That's pretty high of all foreign born residents in the United States. That Mexico accounted for more than a quarter. So that's 25%. 25% of, but we don't know how many, what's the base value. The largest share for any country to contribute since 1890, when about 30% of the country's foreign born population was from Germany. The largest share for any country to contribute. The largest share for any is the word share correct? The largest share, the largest percentage, maybe, I don't know. Two contribute, I think this A seems okay. I don't know what's wrong with it. Okay, this is, has contributed. The largest share that I need to contribute. Aha. Uh -huh. Has, con I think the largest share that I need to I don't think this makes sense. The largest share that any country has contributed since 1890. This is talking about as if, I think you're trying to compare to two countries. You're, you're trying to compare to the percentage of two countries. What the percentage share that each country has contributed. B seems to be suggesting that Mexico's contribution in 1890 versus Mexico's contributions today, as of 2000. I don't think this is right. So which is wrong, obviously. Having the largest share to be contributed, having Yeah, this is talking about the largest share since 1890. This is a this is a modifier, I guess. We can get rid of it. The largest share since 1890. This is talking about as if you're comparing Mexico's share in 1890 versus Mexico's share today. So I, I will get rid of that. I think DNA is just having the largest to be contributed, having the largest share to have been contributed. That just sounds wrong. I would select A at this point. The word D and E having the largest share to be contributed by any country. What, what does that mean? Having, which tense is that? I'm not even sure. Having the largest share just once. Yeah, I'm not sure what those tenses are. Having the large, okay. It's as 
I don't like this word having. You don't need it actually. If you get rid of it, the largest share of any country to contribute. Yeah. I don't think the word having makes sense to me personally. I don't know what tense it is. That's something I need to look into. I suppose having the pizza yesterday made me sick. What tense is this? Having X made me sick. I think this maybe actually is a gerund. Having X made me sick. Having the largest share, having X to be contributed by any country. Having the largest share, having the largest, having the donation, having the donation to be sent to bank Y. I think this is just one large um, gerund noun phrase. This is one large subject, I think. To having the largest share. Having the largest share. X to be contributed. I'm not sure what, what is the tense of this. Uh, yeah, I think at this point I would select A, but I would like to look into D and E. Okay. Of all the record companies, of all the record companies involved in early jazz, all the record companies involved in early jazz, the three most prominent are were C, V, and O. So this is telling me that if it's no longer true today, three most prominent. So is this no longer true today? This, the, this past tense tells me that it's no longer true today as of 2021. Is that, is that the intended meaning? Maybe. All the rest. Maybe that is. Aha. Uh -huh. The three most prominent record companies of all the ones. The th oh boy. Three, three most record companies. Where is, it seems like the word the is missing here. The three most, the three most prominent record companies of all the ones that win. Also, this word, this seems like a preposition. The word the is missing almost. Three most record companies were color the three most rec prominent record companies. You see the word the is missing on top. So it's missing a the over here. That's why the three most, if I, if I don't have that the, if I don't have the the, three most record companies, also the place were Columbia V off the three. Of all the record companies involved, of all the, I think the word the is missing. Okay, this is passive tense. X, Y, and Z were of all the three of them that were the most, the three of them that were the most. This is just bad. I think this is just passive voice. X, Y, and Z were of all the... I think this here is misplaced. I think it should be taught, it should be in my view. Oh, 
only talking about this. It should be. It should be attached to this. Whereas in this case, there is a, it's misplaced because it could also mean, could refer to this. So that's why I'm getting rid of C personally. It just is a bad placement. Were the three most prominent of all record companies? This seems to be okay. X, Y, Z. Were the three most prominent of all? Were three most prominent? Were three most? Were the three most prominent of all? This is saying that X, Y, and Z were. I think it's missing the word the, again, just like in B, I think it's missing word three most prominent of all. It's missing the word the. That's why I will get rid of that. Out of all the record companies that win. Mm, this seems like a good contender too, E. Out of all, off all, the, of all, out of all, of all the record companies, out of all the record companies, there were three of them. There were them. I think E makes more sense actually, even though it's longer. of all the record companies involved in early jazz, out of all the record companies. Yeah, between A and E, I'm just not sure. I will go for E. Of It just sounds better to my ear, but maybe it's wrong. Of all the record companies involved in early jazz, the three most prominent were Yeah, between A and E, no idea, no idea. I just select A or E, just guess. Okay, the computer company reported strong second quarter earnings. Okay, Microsoft reported strong earnings that surpass Wall Street's estimates, that surprise X's estimates, that surprise estimates. That doesn't even make sense. That surprised estimates? No, that has surprised Wall Street's estimates. I don't know if this is accurate. That's an adjective that surprised Wall Street. and announced, reported X and announced the first in a series of price cuts intended to increase for for I think these two should be parallel. The company reported X and announced Y.
I don't think. I think these two should be parallel. Reported X and announced Y. I don't think this is parallel. Can the reporter that surpassed and announced, you can't say that surpassed estimates and announced reported earnings that surpassed, that makes sense. That company reported earnings that announced in a first, I don't think That makes sense. Let's see. The report of the company shows strong. Yeah. No. Yeah. So the word they is wrong. Oh, the report of the comp. That is wrong, definitely. Because that's singular. So passing estimates, the report of the... I think the word day is wrong again. The, com the computer come here. Can this be parallel to this? Reported strong announcing the first. I don't think these two can be parallel because this is suggesting that the gray is what as a result of this that doesn't make sense that doesn't make sense because that's an adverbial modifier the computer company surpassing estimates no it's the report while announcing that to increase. This seems to be suggesting that they are going subsequently. There would be, I don't think that's right. So I'm not very good at it, but I think I will go with A at this point for this one. I think, yeah, because it has, these two have to be parallel reported X and announced Y. If you, so I, I, I will go with D, I chose D.